Welcome to the Humorous Review, where we're going to see how many days in a row we can post a new video. Please join us. Yesterday at Walmart, I offered David popcorn chicken or chicken nuggets from McDonald's. He chose He loves chicken nuggets and french fries. Between the cash registers was a giant display for McDonald's new pretzels called Gourmet Twists. This is a misnomer because the giant pretzels are neither gourmet nor twists. This review will answer the questions, do they taste good? Would I recommend them? Are they a good value? I'll begin with, what the heck is up with all the flies in McDonald's? David and I were eating at a McDonald's inside a Walmart and we had to leave the restaurant and go eat in the car because there were so many flies swarming around. I don't understand how two of the largest multinational corporations in the world can't get together to figure out how to keep the flies out. Now back to the review. How were the gourmet twists presented? The counter display is attractive. I wonder how places like Subway and McDonald's create bread displays that last for days. They were courteous to give us our pretzel in its own bag. I thought, that's smart, to not allow the pretzel to absorb other smells and flavors. When I reached in to grab the pretzel, it was served very hot. Hot! <laughs> Both cheeks coming. There is a lovely honesty to a five-year-old critic. How do they taste? Awful. Just awful. There's a layer of oily sheen around the entire pretzel. I won't waste your time discussing subtleties of taste because these are horrible. Blow on it. Ah. My wife thought it tasted like chemicals. Lucas and I thought it was too salty. I thought the breading was too dense, homogenous, and processed. And David? Well, David just communicated he didn't want any more. We didn't finish the pretzel between the four of us. How's the aftertaste? Pasty. Do you want some more? You just want to wash your mouth out. Are they a good value? No! Th these things maybe cost McDonald's 25 cents to produce and they can sell them for two dollars. But McDonald's is making a big mistake associating their franchise with such a poor quality food product. You said salty? So what do you think? Uh, very salty. Would you buy them again? No. <laughs> David, what do you think of the pretzels? Great. Oh, good. good. Welcome to the reverse Yeah. Okay. What rating do I give it on a scale from 1 to 10? On a scale from 1 to 10, where 10 is the highest, you know, I give this a fail. Out of respect for the other foods I've reviewed, I'm not even going to give this a number. Let's just say these pretzels are a fail. Do you have something you'd like us to review? Please leave your request in the comments. Tomorrow I'll be reviewing three different kinds of Kraft macaroni and cheese, trying to answer the question, is there a difference? And is one kind worth more time and effort than the others? David is very excited because he and I will prepare three different kinds of Kraft macaroni and cheese tomorrow. If you want us to create new reviews, then please rate, comment, or subscribe. Thank you.